Okay, so all the tail that we leave earlier, so you need to hide it and cut, all right, all the tail that we have. And now we're going to make lining inside the bag. So you're going to cut the fabric, like probably like bigger than the bag a little bit. I'm going to cut about 12 inches. See? I'm not good at that, so it's just some idea. <laughs> All right, so and um, I will meet you guys when you cut the fabric and then sew the side of fabric for both side, okay? Okay, when you have the fabric cut and sewing on the side, see this what I cut it and sew it about. 11 inches and now you see but I'm I just cut it too long <laughs> I just you know just in case so it's the bottom of the bag that's how I sew I sew one side already and I'm gonna show you guys how to sew the other side so you're gonna Hold the fabric like so. See, the bottom of the bag is three inches, so you're gonna sew this side three inches as well. Okay, like I say, I'm not that good at it. I'm still learning, so. This is what it look like inside, on the right side. Alright, so you just make the same. I'm going to do the same as the other side and then I will meet you guys when I have both sides sewn. Alright. Okay, when you have both sides sewn on the bottom. So you can uh, leave it like this or you can cut this out as well so I just gonna leave it like this so bring the bag so I just uh, cut it so long you know I gonna fold it or you can cut as well but I don't wanna cut it so have to be the same side of the bag. Put it in there. Make sure the lighting is on the side. See this line? Have to be on the side of the bag. And yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how to sew that. So bring sewing needle and a thread in there. I'm just gonna use the white thread so you guys can see. So I clip it like this. It's help me to sew it straight. I'm gonna start right here. I'm gonna sew in the uh, handbag first. gonna do that two time to uh, lock the thread and now I'm gonna come to the fabric see so in the fabric in there and take up like that and go back to the handbag
and then sew into fabric And then go into handbag and then come back to the fabric. and go into the handbag and come back to the fabric and go to the handbag and come back to the fabric and go to the handbag so you don't have to sew like I sew you can sew your own style but I feel like sew like this it turned out like really good and you cannot see the thread so I just like sewing like this alright so you just keep sewing this till you come to where you start and then I will meet you guys there when you come to the end it don't look like this and we gonna gonna tie a knot for the thread like so Make sure it's secured. And then you're gonna cut the thread. And now we're done sewing the lining inside. Yay! For the side of the bag, I gonna bring the loop. So I'm not sure what to call this, so I just call the loop. So your loop and my loop doesn't have to be the same. So we're gonna take it out. Like so. and put it around here oops wrong side <laughs> and put this part in here and then go through the back like so 
Alright, and now I'm gonna skip four stitches of the gray stitch. Okay, so one, two, three, and four. And then and put this into the fifth stitch, right? So it's very tricky part. So alright. Finally. And then um gonna put into this hole from this side okay and lock it okay we have one side already okay we done making one side and we're gonna do the same with the other side All right and I'm gonna show you guys how to do that okay bring the loop do the same take this part out bring the bag and bring the loop here I'm gonna insert right there into the gray color stitch all right and now I'm gonna skip four stitches the gray color so one two three and four and then insert this into the fifth stitch right same with that side it's pretty hard to put it in all right and then I gonna put this part into the um, loop hole like so and then lock it And yay that's what I have so far I hope you guys have the same so this is for handle so if you guys don't want to make a handle it can be the crush bag as well okay for the handle you need to bring the chain loop and then bring the yarn put on the back like so okay and insert the needle into that loop and pull up the yarn and chain one okay and now we're gonna insert the needle into that loop again put the yarn up it's like single crochet so I will call this first single crochet okay and now do the same insert the needle into that loop and then single crochet this is second single crochet and do that again insert the needle into that loop and then single crochet and now we have three single crochets you need to make one more we're gonna make four single crochet in there Okay, so one more. Okay, and then chain one. Turn it over and single crochet into each stitch. Don't forget the very first stitch. One, two, three, and four. All right and then chain one turn it over and do the same single crochet into each stitch don't forget the very first stitch one two three and four and then chain one turn it over 
Do the same single crochet into each stitch. Don't forget the very first stitch. Okay, and chain one, turn it over. Do the same single crochet into each stitch. Don't forget the very first stitch. Okay, so you just keep repeating this till you have. I gonna make around twenty inches, or you can make as long as you like. Okay, now I have about twenty inches, or you can have as long as you like. For this die, I don't want to make that too long, so. I'm gonna chain one and turn it over and bring the chain loop put in the back like so and then I'm gonna skip the first stitch okay skip this one and single crochet into this one but you have to pull through the loop like so pull the yarn up like single crochet and then single crochet into next stitch but have to pull through the loop like so and then last stitch we're gonna make slip stitch so insert the needle in there pull up the loop and pull through like so and then cut the yarn after you cut the yarn you're gonna put you know, try to hide the yarn. Alright, so we're done making handle. So now I'm gonna show you how to uh, put the handle into the handbag. That's how you put. Okay, I like this bag. You know, the good thing about it, I can hold this bag like a uh, crust bag or I put the shoulder in and you know it's so I love it so much so yeah I hope you enjoy making this like I do so yeah if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe on my channel thank you so much for watching bye